going guys? It's uh, Christmas Eve back here in Bayonne, New Jersey, my hometown. Going to be doing a little bit of fishing down on First Street, uh, downtown Bayonne. Uh, beautiful day out, high 30, should get in the 40s, nice and sunny. Uh, water's pretty cold. Last time I was here it was freezing and all I caught were a bunch of uh, short stripers and some white perch. So I'm thinking it's going to be more of the same today, but we will give it a shot. Alright, hope you guys like it. All right, so first setup's gonna be a high-low rig. Got some small pieces of blood worms uh, and a two ounce sinker. So we will give this a shot. Last time I was here, I had a lot of success with this one. There are a lot of small fish. It's about a month later now. So water got even colder. So I'm assuming it's gonna be a lot more of the same, a lot more smaller fish. Second setup's a little bit different. Got a uh, fish finder rig, three ounce sinker, and we'll see what happens on this one. Got a whole blood worm on this one. So I'm hoping some bigger fish find it, but don't have high hopes for that today. So we will see. So I was pulling my line up here, and I've got a ton, ton, ton of seaweed. Felt like I was snagged. But underneath all this, we've got a tiny little striper. Now, if you thought the ones in my last video were, were small, you haven't seen anything yet. Look at this little guy. But you never know what you're going to get. Thought I was snagged, ended up having a little, little fish. So this is what you sometimes encounter when you are fishing this kind of area. So it's outgoing tide right now. Tide's moving out. Both my lines just got snagged down this giant pile of, I don't want to call it trash, but not sure what it is. So now I got to bring that in and I'm fighting the tide. Fun stuff. Pretty sure my other rod is snagged on something too. Pretty sure I just lost it. Lost my setup. Yep. There's nothing on here. Right, got the high low rig rigged up again, ready to go. Hopefully the action picks up a bit. Tide's still outgoing. Current's moving pretty quickly. But let's see what happens. All right, fish finder rig, ready to go. Let's just talk a second about how expensive these blood worms are. So I don't mind not catching fish, but I hate when they take one of these worms because they're over a dollar a piece. I think I paid $14 for a dozen. That's super expensive for a worm. Had a small hit on this rod again. Come on. Nothing on it yet. I think there's a fish, but then again, I thought there was a fish last time too. Uh, no, I'm pretty sure there's a fish this time for sure. Let's find out here. Yeah. Tiny little striper of the number two of the day. Five, six inches at most, but that's wintertime fishing for you down here. Such a cute little guy. So cool thing about these guys is that he was probably born earlier this year. So when all these bass came up here to spawn in the spring, that guy was probably born. Made it through his first summer and hopefully he keeps growing.
just had a hit on the fish finder rig. Not sure if there's anything still here. Oh. Yeah, it's gonna be a small fish. But action is action at this point. Wintertime fishing usually slow. Not too much action. Fish are gonna be smaller. What do we got? Alright, white perch, different species for the day. Not too bad. Let's again check this out. Reeling in just to check my bait. Didn't even feel it, but another tiny little striper. catch one more fish but I've been out here about four and a half hours now uh, haven't caught anything in probably the last two two and a half so most of the action uh, came on the outgoing nothing during low tide a couple bites here on the incoming but didn't uh, hook up on anything so that's kind of how winter fishing goes uh, all the big fish move out or offshore you got a lot of small fish left around in the bays and estuaries so I caught those for sure a couple small stripers and surprisingly the white perch was bigger than all the stripers I caught today so that's the way it goes sometimes so I hope you guys liked it I will see you next time